Welcome back to the channel everyone. Today I'm going to show you how I use Sysix Librarian and Dex to add sounds to my 1987 Yamaha DX7. So I'm going to jump right into how you link these and how you get the software talking. So first you're going to want to link these MIDI to USB to your computer. Now I'm using these simple little USB to MIDI converter cables. Now these work for some people sometimes, sometimes they don't. This red pair here doesn't work for me but this silver pair I have plugged in does. Um, if they don't work for you any audio interface that has MIDI in and out should work and they also make MIDI transmitters and such. So right now I have this set up to um, just a factory ROM here that I put on. So if I switch it I've got my factory ROM 1 that would have came with this thing in 83. So what you're gonna want to do here is you're gonna want to set up the DX7 to receive and transmit MIDI. So you're going to want to hit function, which it's already there where I've been messing with it. And then you're going to hit eight over here. And that will give you your MIDI channel option here. It's going to be set to channel one because that's the channel that's going to talk to a Sysix librarian for you. And you can change over here with your, uh, with your dial, your buttons, just like how you change your parameters. So make sure it's set to one. And then you're going to want to hit function and then you're going to want to hit eight again. And that's going to bring up your system info. And it says right now, it says system info unavailable. You're going to want this to say available. So if you change your uh, dial over here again, just like you would changing your algorithms or whatever, you can change it to available. So then after that, you're going to want to hit your internal memory and then as you can see there your internal memory protection is on you're going to want to hit your yes no buttons your plus one buttons to turn it off and that's going to open up your memory for it to receive the patches from the computer so over here on the computer i have dex set up and then i have sysix librarian set up on the sysix librarian you're going to want to go through and you're going to want to select whatever input. So right now I have the USB MIDI interface, but you're going to want to choose whatever you're using. So I have some patches already brought up, but if you want, I'll add some um, links to some of the cool websites. We can get tons of patches. You can get all the factory ROMs and everything for these. So if you hit cartridge here, now all of my saved patches are here in this file. So if I hit show directory, it's going to bring up all my patches. So we're doing a Mad Villain tribute show, which is the MF Doom Mad Lib thing. We're doing the entire Mad Villain album or Mad Villainy album. We did it for Halloween, but we're going to do it again. So I need to put these patches back on my DX7 that I made for that set. So right here I have my Mad Villain DX7 voices. So I can just drag that over to Sysix Librarian. And there it is. So I highlight that that's selected then I hit play and so you can see right there MIDI received and now if I go over here and hit my internal again oh, these button these old buttons I hate them so as you can see there now if I scroll through I've got the tracks of the Mad Villainy album that I want accordion Bistro, Raid, Sick Fit, Rainbows, Curls. So now I've got all the sounds that I need for my Mad Villain tribute show. So that is how you add sounds to the uh, DX7.